dun 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 nom 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 in this video i'm going to show you how to make the perfect mackerel flapper it's a nice big bait for bass or conger and you can use this bait from either the shore or from a boat so we start by slicing the mackerel from the tail up to the head along the backbone turn him over and do the same thing again from the tail end we slice away from ourselves along the backbone and stop when we get to the head now we take the mackerel we place him kind of uh, the right way up so to speak and spread the two flaps apart and we're going to cut out the backbone and we're going to remove that backbone and that tail completely and there we have it a mackerel flapper now if we're fishing off the boat we'll keep both of those flaps on but if we're fishing from the shore we're going to remove one of the flaps this makes the bait a bit lighter but this bait still has plenty of scent in it to attract the fish we'll keep the fillet to one side as a spare bait now we're going to take a 5-0 hook because this is uh, ideal for fishing off the shore and we're going to open the mouth of the mackerel push the mouth right open take the hook and we're going to put it through the top part of the mouth and through the top of the head so that that barb is exposed and that's perfect for off the beach if we we're fishing off the boat though it's very important that we'd close the mouth use a bigger hook and feed it through the bottom there and out through the top of the head and the, the reason for doing that, that is it stops it spinning on the way down dun 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 nom 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 Blah. 